We're at the California Science Center in Exposition Park, and you are in the outdoor garden of an ancient uh, home in ancient Pompeii before the eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD. What do you think is the uh, interest in Pompeii uh, amongst uh, everyone, really? I think it comes on a number of levels. One is this idea of disaster, and those of us who oh, yeah. live along the ring of fire were faced with this unpredictability of what the natural world is going to give us. Also, we have an eyewitness account, so there's that human dimension of reacting to the disaster. And then there's what's been preserved, which is a picture unlike anywhere else, where we don't just have the grand buildings of the Roman capital, but we have daily life. We have statues of puppies, we have foodstuffs, we really get under the skin of the individuals. And so I think it appeals on a number of levels to different people. Well, you would be seeing artifacts within the rooms that they would occur. So for instance, here in this room, this is a garden. There would be the, the public area outside the private rooms of a very elite house. And the garden was fashioned like the Greeks liked the garden, a paradise for animals in a beautiful, peaceful place where they would bring out their couches and dine in the evening. And you have a beautiful fountain here to my right that would be flowing with water. You would go into the other galleries and see beautiful sculptures in bronze and in marble. Um, you would see uh, uh, images of the Forum, the central place of life in Pompeii. We also have an eruption theater, which sort of gives you an experience of the devastation of uh, Mount Vesuvius before that opens into the, the exhibit where you have the body casts. In Los Angeles, the California Science Center features Pompeii on another edition of Out and About with Roger Martin. Thank you.